There we go. What was the fail? Hey, friends. Welcome in. I have a special helper tonight. The hubby's here. I think I'm also streaming live on YouTube, so I'm just checking that out. We're getting this started. We are on YouTube. I think I'm Let me get that going. Let's get a giveaway going. Hi, Lori. Miss Lori's in the house here. Welcome in, friends. Tonight, we are starting our glass giveaway off with this glass chess piece. It is a seashell. We have all the friends in the house, so go ahead and get in on that giveaway. I'm starting just a minute early here. Get some music going for you. Hubby is backing me up tonight. Welcome in, welcome in. So right now this is what's streaming on YouTube and I'm kind of checking to see if anyone's in the chat. And then this is the tab for what we see on both screens here. But now I'll go over to the auction tab because that's where all the items are we're gonna run. Hey, Auntie Christy, everyone's here for the glass sale, yay! Welcome, welcome. I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a little sneaky peek again of everything that's in the shop tonight. We have all the sun catchers in the buy it now section. So those are available. You can purchase those before the sale even starts. I don't know if that'll help with your shipping or not, or get you to that $8 quicker. And then this is all the glass we have this evening. And I am happy to jump around out of order. So go ahead and check out the shop catalog. And if there's something you want me to run first, I'm happy to do it. So we are running the shell, letting some people come in. Oh, you have the Ellie Smith bird, Christy. That's cool. Welcome in, guys. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, Erin. And I'm going to make Colleen a helping mod just to, while you're in here. And yay. All right, guys. Well, I want to get this sale going for you. So we're going to let it. It's right now. This uh, this uh, giveaway is running with two minutes left. Oh, you can see that says shell on there. Cool. But it doesn't say. Oh, and I guess I'd, I let international shipping happen. Okay. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and run the giveaway. Here we go. It's running. Who's going to be the winner? Blue Flamingo Lori wins it. I am shocked that you won the seashell. <laughs> Congratulations, girl. All right, guys. We're going to... So this is what... I go to product actions. Product actions. Pin it. Hand-painted fish glass. I have it up here already. And then... I'm teaching my hubby how to run the whatnot to help me out if I need it. So I put it up there and then this is where you can start the auction. So we have this hand painted fish glass shot glass, super, super cute with the big old eyes. It's going to start at $8, no issues. And it is signed B starting that at $8. So you hit start auction and I like to run mine for 20 seconds. So that should be set now. And then you just hit start. And it's away, running for 20 seconds, the shot glass. And like I said, guys, if you see anything in the shop you want, feel free to shout it out. Mods, I appreciate your help tonight. You're awesome. Just moving this a little, because on YouTube, there's a big icon right over it. All right, guys. So we're going to go to the next item. And it's the blue fish that I have right here. So we're going to let John figure out how to pin that real quick. We have this beautiful polished bottom blue and white striped fish. There is a little, I don't know if that's like a foil bubbling, but perfect. We've got this pinned. It's going to start at $9. So we're going to start the auction. It's going to run for 20 seconds. And away we go. 
This fish is now running for 20 seconds. Thank you to my mods. I appreciate it. Beautiful fish running. See what I mean about the commercials? Oh, voice to text fail. All right, guys, we're going to run the next fish now. So this is a pretty green one, a little bit like an angel fish. Really, really nice, smooth bottom, no issues. Nice green and clear. We're gonna get that started for 20 seconds. <laughs> You're sitting on your hands, Lori. That's okay. So next up is going to be the little amber hobnail vase. Yep. Thank you, babe. So this one can go back. Thank you very much. So next up, we have a little nice hobnail piece for you. This is just a small, um, it's four inches tall, amber hobnail ruffle bud vase starting at $6 for 20 seconds. I know the fall is almost there. We can start dreaming, folks. Halloween's three months away. It is three months from Sunday. No. Yeah. Three months from Sunday. Christmas is only four months away. The cool weather is coming, my Floridian friends. All right. Next up, we have a small Millie Fiore paperweight. And it is a little baby, but it is gorgeous. It is only one and three quarter inches in diameter. So you can see it in my hand there. It is a little guy, but it is beautiful. I'm going to go ahead and get this one started at $27 for 20 seconds. Beautiful Mila Fiore mini paperweight. There is the bottom. The holidays are coming, my friends. Yes, there you go, guys. Up next are those two green candle holders. Thank you, guys. So up next, we have some green anchor hawking pinch glass candle holders. There is a chip on the inside of this one right here. Right there, there is a little chip, but otherwise these are in very nice condition. Avocado candle holders, great with the holidays coming. You can put your candles and your little ornaments in there. They're starting at $5 for the pair for 20 seconds. Next up is the little white palm nail. Lakeshore Finds is winning. Yay, Colleen. Thank you so much, Colleen. These will be great for your holiday. I appreciate it. So those went to Colleen for $5. Next up, we have this little hobnail um, nappy dish, a little candy dish with a little bit of white. Again, I think this would be beautiful with like blue and other color ornaments for the holidays coming up because you could see all the ornament colors through the hobnail starting at five dollars for 20 seconds now so you guys can see and i don't know the make on this one it might be an indiana glass by the bottom i'm not clear Don't let Eric hear that, Erin. <laughs> Miss Lori's winning. Beautiful little hobnail piece. And Lori Blue Flamingo wins that for $5. Thank you, guys. Next up, we have a swan. Indiana glass, Erin. Uh, Next up, we have a master swan salt cellar. 
It's this beautiful clear glass, no issues. So this would be the master salt cellar. Let me put it on a little pedestal for you. It's going to start at $5. And this would even be cute as a little trinket dish for like your rings and stuff. You could probably even fit some cube tips in there. Mm, might be a little short for that. But that's going to start at $5 for 20 seconds. Yeah, I threw in a few little $5 because I have some, you know, like higher end. And then I wanted to, you know, give a variety of prices for people. Thank you for sharing, Colleen. I appreciate you. Next up, we have some Bristol glass. It's a tall white um, floral vase with painted flowers. I picked this up on my trip to St. Pete. A lot of my St. Pete glass is in this sale. It's this beautiful, tall, white satin glass ruffle, hand-painted flowers. I loved the orange. Something about the way the green and the gray and the orange came together. A little bit rough pontiel on the bottom there. And then there's a little bit of age wear underneath right there. I don't think it's marked on the back, so let me double check for you. No, there's no, and it does have like a little bit of silver color loss right there from age. But we're gonna get this started at $28 for 20 seconds. This beautiful Bristol glass floral vase with ruffle detail. Next up is the block in the back. Thank you. All right, guys. So this one's coming down now. And next up, we have some Fenton. This one I bought from George the Antique Nomads booth in St. Pete. It is a black Fenton ruffle thumbprint vase. There is some water staining on the interior. Let me see if I can get in there for you. If it'll focus. There is like a little bit of water staining on the interior. But perfect for your Halloween decor coming up. This one is running now. Black handkerchief pedestal. Fenton maze is now running. I almost thought of keeping it for me, but I have a really cool like black hobnail egg thing I like. So I thought I would share this one. I thought that was pretty too. Thanks, mom. My mom's watching on YouTube, guys. So next up, we have a cranberry glass vase. Because uh, we don't have, my, my mom's not on whatnot, so I, I go live on YouTube so she can see. So this screams 90s to me. That kind of, the magenta with the clear applied swoop and the clear base and the ruffle top, no issues. We're starting it at $18 for 20 seconds and it's eight inches tall, cranberry glass with applied swirl, looks almost like a snake wrapping around it. And it's a ribbed texture. The little owls next. Okay, there you go, darling. Thank you. John's handing me everything. He's helping out tonight. So next up, we have this uh, Amberina Owl. And I want to check if, I can't remember if this one does glow or not. So I want to check that for you guys. So it's this cute little owl picture. I'll let you get all the detail first. With the applied handle. All right, guys, light's going to change. So it does have some Amberina glow, especially around the face. I'm going to get that started at $25 for 20 seconds. It does have the Amberina in the chest and around the nose. So it does have some, and then there's some in the handle as well. 
So nice Amberina owl picture. Light's gonna come back on. Let our eyes adjust, the camera adjust. All right. Next we have a blue satin glass curvy clear bottom vase. This one, I just really loved the shape and look. I know, I know. I just loved the curves. It almost looks like a leg. I just realized that. Like if you put like a little fishnet thingy on it, it could almost be a leg. So it's got the white frosted bottom, blue frosted vase, kind of cool, kind of art deco. We're gonna get started at $15 for 20 seconds. And this is really beautiful, vibrant blue. Thanks, Mom. It's a major award. Oh, there we go. There we go. <laughs> My mom's watching over on YouTube, guys, if you hear me saying thank you. All right. Let's see what's next. All right. Next up, this I also got at George's booth. It's a Viking yellow swung. Um, it's a bud base. There is a little scuffing on the satin right here, if you can see it, which happens sometimes. And there's a little staining from water stains. But it's a yellow satin glass. And we're starting it at $45 um, for 20 seconds. So it's the Viking Satin Yellow Bud Vase. 11 inches tall, two inches diameter. I had it in purple also, but I just sold that one. Like I said, there is just a little bit of interior from water. Next is the purple flower frog. All right, guys. And remember, I'm happy to hop back and show anything if you guys are looking in the shop. So this I've never seen before, guys. I've never seen a purple flower frog. So this is a really pretty purple lilac flower frog. It says patent April 11th, 1916. I just now noticed that. So this is antique, guys. This is from 1916, or the patents from 1916. But this is really pretty purple. And this would look great with marbles on it if you have like a black light marble collection. It almost looks like it has a swirl to it, but that's just the cut of the glass. Hey, Miss Pamela, how you doing? Miss Pamela Bam is in the house. We're gonna get this started at $15 for 20 seconds. Up, oh, Lori, you weren't sitting on your hands. <laughs> I've never seen a purple one. Oh, okay. So this is one of the white ones that may have turned purple. Auntie Christy, thank you, Lori. That one's going to you. So that one was one, guys. So next up, we have a blowing glass, beautiful Voda vase. Just, I love the colors on this. It's this like gorgeous amber to green to blue, blowing glass. This reminds me of like a summer sunset in the desert. It is starting at $8 for 20 seconds. Uh-oh. <laughs> All Aaron had to hear was orange and desert. <laughs> That'll be really pretty, girl. I like this one a lot. Thanks for coming in, friends. I appreciate it. This one is going to Thorny Crown. Thank you, Erin. I think I'm going to hop down to the bottom and do some little guys real quick for you. So let's do some. I have a blue flower frog for you. So this one is a made in England. It's a little tiny 12 hole flower frog. So this one is from England. It is starting at $12 and we're running it for 20 seconds. <laughs> Thank 
Thank you, Miss Lori. Blue Flamingo is in the lead. Congratulations, Lori. Okay. Why'd you say no? Did you not mean to bid on it? So next up we have an amber crackle glass pitcher with applied handle. I'm running some of my little smaller guys as folks come in. This one is starting at $8 for 20 seconds. Little amber crackle glass, applied handle, no issues. Next up, we have another little crackle glass pitcher. This one is red and amberina. Michelle's in the house. We've got all the friends tonight. Thank you, guys. We've got this pretty crackle glass. Michelle, John's helping. Uh, crackle glass, amberina, mini pitcher. It does have the amberina in the base. We're starting it at $10 for 20 seconds. He's helping hand me the glass so I'm not running back and forth in, in all the, the lovely heat. <laughs> Lori's in the house. Yep, we got all the friends. Light's coming back, guys. Sorry to blind you. All right. I'm going to go back up top now. Was just mixing it up a little bit. So next up, we have a Moser Blue Owl. Now, it does not glow in my black light. I only have the one version, though. But this is a Moser. There's the little M on the back. He is a blue glass owl. Now, I have one that was my grandmother's. And that one really, really glows. This one, I don't really... Unless you get really close... Then you see a little bit of it on the interior. So this is probably a newer one because the older ones had a lot more of that like lead and uranium in it. So we're starting it for 20 seconds now. The owl is running. The bird is next, sweetie. I can grab that. All right, guys. Do you have that, hun? <laughs> Michelle's picking on me because I'm calling you sweetie. Okay, next up, I have this Ellie Smith bird. It is the blue satin. Now, I do want you to know that there are a little bit of chips in the satin on the bottom. And there is a little bit of, like, the black rub that happens sometimes on the satin glass. Other than that, it's in very nice condition. Holly's yelling now because everyone's here. So we're going to start it at $8 for 20 seconds. This Ellie Smith Bluebird. Nice satin. Your Aunt Shell says hello, Holly. We're running this guy at $8. Feel free to check out the shop. Everyone coming in. We appreciate it. Don't forget, I have a ton of fun sun catchers in the buy it now section also for you guys. So next up, we have a sit in snicker. A sit in snicker bowl. So this is where the texture and everything is applied on the second surface. Or it's got the texture on the second surface. But it's sit in stricker glass. I know, right? Beautiful white with the holidays and the snow coming. Starting at $20 for 19 seconds. We will get that running. And I'm happy to take requests if you're checking out the shop. We are on item, about to be on item 20. It's a little black. Thank you. Yeah, I thought that was pretty. I'd not seen it before, so I wanted to learn about it. Next up, we have, this is a Fern and Holly 
black glass, not amethyst, solid black, little mini footed um, planter. And this would be really cute, I think, if you want to do kind of like a uh, Nightmare Before Christmas theme or just to use with like some of your um, bottle brush, Halloween bottle brush trees. We're starting at $8 for 20 seconds. Like I can just picture this with like those um, candy corn looking bottle brushes in it. I think that would be really cute. Right? Can you see that? Like the candy corn? Yippers. My favorite month is coming. Oh, we hear you, Holly. Grandma hears you. Everyone hears you. All right. So next up, we have another paperweight. And this is another Millefiore one. This one is much bigger. And this one has, it's like red, white, and blue. So it's a little patriotic. It does have one or two little dings right here in the bottom. But otherwise, it's a pretty smooth finish. No issues on the top. It is two and three quarter inches diameter. And we're starting that for 20 seconds at 35. Beautiful Millefiori. I know, it's got a beautiful polished bottom. It didn't have any signatures though. Okay, next is the white, the clear white base. So guys, this is a Fenton clear bud vase. And I think they call it the sunflower pattern, but I couldn't find the exact pattern, but you can see it's got the flowers. It reminds me of the Viking bud one, but it is marked Fenton on the bottom. And this one does not have a number. Wait, it might. I think this one has an eight. I think this one is from the eighties, but there's your Fenton. So it's a little clear bud vase with the floral bottom. It's nine and three quarter inches tall, and we're starting that at $20 for 20 seconds with the nice floral bottom. I hadn't seen that before. Okay. So next up, we have some uranium glass. We have a large uranium dish. Now this one does have a monogram in the center, which I did not realize when I got it, but let me show you how this beauty glows. So this is like a serving tray. It is monogrammed with the letter D in the center, but look at the glow on that. So you see it is etched right there in the center but it is very nice. There are two little chips right there on the corner. D is for dinner, yep. And I think those are the only chips just right on that corner. So I'm gonna get this started for 20 seconds and I'll turn the light back on so you can see that chip, but it glows like crazy guys. And then there's just one little chip right there. Otherwise, that's a beautiful, oh, maybe it is. <laughs> it could be for dill pickles, Chuck. It could be. All right, guys, thank you. Next, we have something for the, um, the classic milk glass lovers. This is a cute, I call these mermaid tails. It's a really cute little mermaid tail white hobnail bud vase starting at $12.00. For 20 seconds, it is five inches tall. And I just like the look of that one with the little like starfish on the bottom. So next up, we have one I've not heard of before. This is a Rosso, R-O-S-S-O, blue glass hand-painted basket. It is hand-painted on one side. 
and it is signed. And when I was, and then there's the R on the bottom. And apparently Fenton and some other companies made baskets for them is what I was kind of seeing. So I just love the beautiful cobalt blue. I just love the beautiful cobalt blue and the flowers. So we're starting this at $30 for 20 seconds. And it's just that amazing, vibrant cobalt. And it's a new to me glass brand. So that was exciting to find. Next is uh, this little guy. All right, guys. Next up, we have this opalescent double handled little, uh, what did I call it? Dish. And now this one may have that ring of fire. I wasn't sure because of the opalescence, but it's got that red, that pinkish color that shows up around the edges. And I thought that was only milk glass, but it's got that beautiful coloring on this. So this may be older. We're starting it at $15 for 20 seconds. My friend Lori taught me about the ring of fire on milk glass. Hey, Bree. Ring of fire, yep. All right, guys. Next up, we have a Fenton Blue Hobnail Cruet. So it's this pretty blue opalescent Fenton Hobnail Cruet. Here is your stopper, which is in nice condition. It's got one little chip right there. Sorry, Holly was making weird sounds. We're going to get this started for 20 seconds. Feel free to check out the shop if you're just joining us. I've got lots of goodies in there tonight. All right. Next up, we have some green candle holders. Now, these are uranium, but they aren't high concentrated uranium. Um, they're a little hard to see the glow on, and I noticed they are a little bit two different tones. They do have a little bit of chipping on the edge. Where did it go? Of course, now I can't find it because I'm live. But I know it was there. And I'm going to turn them upside down. Maybe we'll see. You can see the coloring's a little different on these. I'm going to go ahead and get them. See if I can get them glowing. See, that one shows up a little better than the... There we go. The bottoms really show when you do it this way. So I'm get those started for 20 seconds. The top... There we go. There's that one. And then there's this one. So now they're glowing nicely for me. So $12, thank you for the hearts, friends. I appreciate it. Some uranium glass for your upcoming Halloween. All right, guys. Whoops. Ugh. Sorry what not acting up, guys. Okay. Next up, we have a white hobnail vase. I'm sorry, a white hobnail ruffle bowl. And this one does also have um, the ring of fire on it. So here is the white, and you can see it's a thinner milk glass. And it does have that pinkish tone at the top. There you go. It's showing up there. So let me get that set up to run for you. A very nice hobnail piece. It's not marked on the bottom, but I suspect it's older Fenton. We're starting that at $15 for 20 seconds. Very nice hobnail. It is six and a quarter inches in diameter. Welcome in friends, welcome in. Next up we have a black basket. 
coming up. My husband's helping in the background, so I'm calling out the items. Thank you for considering, guys. Next up, we have this black basket. This is marked Westmoreland. So this is a Westmoreland black glass basket, not painted, not amethyst, just nice black. And can you imagine some of those uh, Halloween flowers sticking out of that? We're starting at 15 for 20 seconds, this Westmoreland glass basket. Perfect for Halloween coming up. Thanks friends for helping with the modding. Okay guys. So be sure if there's anything that uh, you wanna see that I've already shown you shout it out guys, cause we are actually getting close to the end of the show already. So next up we have an amber daisy button shoe. You wanna see the fern and holly again? I can do that. Let me find that. The black fern and holly please, Steve, the little planter, thank you. Let me find that. So here is the little black fern planter. And it's, I think, yeah, it's two, it's like two and a quarter inches tall by two and three quarter inches wide. So a two by two. Let's see if that'll focus in on the pattern. I'm going to get started at $8 for 20 seconds. Thank you, Colleen. Fun pattern. I never seen, I had never seen this pattern before, but apparently there's a whole line of them. I can't wait to see what you do with it. Thank you. Much appreciated, Colleen. That's going to Lakeshore Finds. Friends, if you are a fellow whatnotter, don't forget to throw up some fire emojis so everyone can give you a follow. I know Lakeshore Finds has sales on here, so make sure you're following her. So next up, we have a daisy button shoe. Cute little amber daisy button shoe. This one is not marked by anyone. Oops. So it may be a little Indiana. Little daisy button going on. We're going to start that at $6 for 20 seconds. And then that one's tricky. The little ones next. This. Thank you. She Finds Fab is also a seller, guys. Be sure to check them out. All right, guys. Next up, we have this small hobnail piece. This is a Fenton Blue Opalescent Hobnail Little Mini Creamer. Love that color. Starting at $5 for 20 seconds. Thanks for all the shares and the hearts, friends. I appreciate it. Welcome in, welcome in. And next up, we have a blue boot. So next up, we have this Fenton 70s blue boot. It is marked Fenton. Where did it go? I just had it in focus. Okay. <laughs> it is marked Fenton right there. It does not have a number, so that means it's from the 70s or earlier. And it's this great daisy and button blue high boots. I have a note that there's a small chip on the base. Oh, right here. There's a little tiny chip right there on the bottom in that corner on the inside. We're gonna get that started at $10 for 20 seconds. All right, guys. So next up we have, let's see, a little red shoe. This is an Amberina one. This one is cute because this one has like the little bow on the front and this one is a Boyd. And look at the little bow on the front of the shoe. And this one is Amberina. It does glow in the heel a little bit. 
So we're starting at $12 for 20 seconds, little Amberina shoe. And friends, I am only running through once tonight. So if you're just hopping in and you want to check out the catalog, go ahead and do that. I think we have like four, five or six items left. Yeah, I've never seen the bow one. And I didn't even notice it last time I did the sale. I had it, I didn't notice. <laughs> okay. And I'm just gonna give a pan, friends, for those of you who are just joining. These are the items that are available this evening, still in the catalog. We are almost towards the end. So I just wanted to let you kind of have a little perusal so you can shout out anything before we go through the last few items this evening. Okay. So next up we have another small um, blue hobnail creamer, but it's the taller version. This one is definitely bent in with the super, super sharp hobnail, a taller opalescent one. We're gonna get that started at $8 for 20 seconds. And this is the jewelry. Thank you, sweetie. And then let's see what else we have. Then it's this guy and this guy. If you want to move that. Okay. All right, guys. Okay. Next up, we have some more Fenton. This is something I had not seen before. It's Fenton from the 80s. There's a little eight at the bottom of the F. And there are some chips on this. I think they're on the inside though. And it's a little tiny pink Fenton glass jewelry box. And it has been loved because there's some, there's some chipping around the interior from the lid being taken on and off. It's good for some small necklaces, some rings, maybe a bracelet if it's like a charm bracelet. We're gonna start this at $12 for 20 seconds. Does it glow? Do the pink glow? I don't, I don't think it glows. It's just kind of pink. I don't think so. Yeah, just a pretty little pink jewelry box. All right, guys. Now be sure to go ahead and check out my profile because next week is my vintage variety show. And I have all my jewelry sales and everything else listed on there through October. Okay, so next we have a small, this is one of the little baby hobnails, milk glass. This one is Fenton also. This one does have, let me see, wait. This one also has an eight. So this is an 80s Fenton. Hi, Starbright Collect. Welcome in, folks. So this one does have... It's uh, three inches tall from the 80s. We're starting at $8 for 20 seconds. Cute little hobnail piece. All right, guys. You think it glows? I couldn't tell, so I didn't want to say it does. It was just kind of hard to tell. This guy glows. I have this uranium juicer. It does have some chipping right here. And I think there was another spot. There's a little chip chunk out of the handle. This was from my collection. Very nice uranium starting at $6 for 20 seconds because there is some chipping to it. So it's starting at $6. Welcome in friends, welcome in. Be sure to check out the shop. No worries, Erin, thanks so much for the help. Have a good evening, girl. All right, guys. Let me go back through a few items. Thanks for the help, Dave. 
I'm letting my helper off the hook. <laughs> so next up, I have this little wagon. It's a Princess House clear wagon. Starting at $4 for 20 seconds by Mr. Market. <laughs> oh, I get it. Mr. Market, Side Street Market. <laughs> it took me a second. Can you tell it's been a long week? This is my second whatnot sale this week, and I'm not used to having two in a week, but I'm enjoying it. It's fun. Welcome in. Okay. So next up, I have another little clear press glass piece, and this is a little, yep, a full-time job. I have this little wheelbarrow starting at $4 for 20 seconds. It just happened to fall that way this week, so I had to bump a sale from last week. So I had two this week. If you hear Holly yelling, she's getting her medicine for the evening, and we have to hide it in treats, so she thinks it's treat time. So that usually happens during my sales because she gets her medicine near 7. That's her cat, Holly. I know, right? All right, friends. Well, I have run through the whole entire sale. So I'm going to do my usual last call for those coming in. And uh, I'm going to pan the table. So all the sun catchers are available in the buy it now section. And I'm just going to slowly pan. And if there's anything anyone would like to see, I'm going to give it a couple of minutes and let you guys kind of shout out. You can say blue vase or hobnail and we'll kind of take a look. But this is what is still available for you guys this evening. We have some tiny Millie Fiore paperweights, some Moser owl, Amberina owl pitcher, some cranberry glass, some Bristol glass. We have some small fish this evening. Some Fenton, some vases in the back there, Viking satin glass. So we have run through the shop. So I'm just giving last call and thank you to all my mods for helping out tonight. I really appreciate it. Yeah, Christy, I tried to do a little bit of everything for folks. So I'm doing last call, guys. If there's something you'd like to see, I have some fish left, some uranium, 28. Okay, let me slowly take you guys back over. Let me find number 28. Okay, so those are the, these are the green uranium glass. This one does have a little chip on the bottom. Let me make sure I'm pointing this properly for you guys. And I think I'm just double checking. I think that was the only spot that it looked like it had the little chip there. And these are two slightly different shades of green, just so you're aware, but they do glow. So I'm gonna get them started for 20 seconds, if you're still interested. If not, thank you so much, Happily. Much appreciated. These are going home with Happily. Congratulations on your first purchase from me. We'll go ahead and take another look at the table as folks are coming in. This is what we have available this evening. So I'm still running down last call because someone was still looking. So I don't want to stop while folks are still shopping. We've got some owls. We've got some fish. We've got a swan salt cellar. Bristol, Fenton, Curvy Bays. Fenton Clear Vase, Ellie Smith Bird, lots of little hobnails. So I'm just going to pan for another minute. I'm going to call it at 650. Thank you, Happily. Guys, I do have black light keychains in the uh, Buy It Now. 
So if you like those, I do have those available for your blacklight needs. <laughs> I always keep one on one of my keychains. Uh, thanks, Happily. I'm doing a final pan, guys. We're going to close down here in another minute. So if there's anything you'd like to see, let me know. And then next week, I will be back with my vintage variety sale, which is already almost fully stocked. I think I've completed listings on that one. If you want to check that out. All right, friends. And we have some sun catchers still in the shop. Well, thank you all. You've been a wonderful audience this evening. I will see you guys once again next week on Thursday. Have a great evening and thanks to my mods for helping out. And thanks for hanging out, friends. Have a good evening, everyone.